Devin Vassell knocked down seven threes in the play-in game versus the Pelicans. Devin does a great job of finding three-point shots by relocating on the three-point line, especially when one of his teammates puts the ball on the floor and attacks the paint. Devin does a great job of repositioning himself to give the driver a nice kickout option if needed, and on this night was ready to catch and knock him down. Six out of seven threes came in this natural flow of either in transition or somebody just driving and kicking and finding him wide open. All of them except this one. In the fourth quarter, Coach Pop pulled this set play out of his bag to find Vassell a wide open shot. So let's break down this quick hitter by the San Antonio Spurs. The Spurs are going to set up this set with the ball in DeJounte Murray's hands, nice and high on the left side of the floor. The video doesn't show this part, but the entry pass goes from Murray to Vassell at midcourt. First action is Jakob coming up to set this high back screen for Murray. On the back side of the floor, we have KJ and Josh Richardson set up in a double down screen to continue to get DJ up and open to receive this pass on the other side from Vassell. Vassell has to dribble over a little bit to set this play up just right. Once Vassell reverses the ball, the screeners will pop out to the three-point line, and then here comes Jakob ready to set this backside action. The next part is the key to why Vassell ends up being so wide open. It's the way that the Pelicans are operating the pick and roll coverage. They are in drop coverage where Valanciunas is going to sink to protect the rim and now you have Alvarado out there about to take a screen on an island from Jakob. What's brilliant about this play is that it overloads one side of the floor to set up the shot that they are looking to create on the opposite side. And if Valanciunas is not going to switch or start hollering screen right, screen right, go under, go under to Alvarado before Jakob gets there, then that leaves Valanciunas with a lot of room to cover to get back out to the three-point line when that skip pass is made and Alvarado ends up getting completely jammed up going over this screen to get through. Bad communication from the Pelicans. Jakob sets this flare screen and Vassell does the rest with great footwork and rhythm getting to his spot and catches this ball under control, balanced, and there are just no Pelicans in sight to contest and Vassell knocks down one of his seven threes on the night. Moving forward into next season, Vassell can use a steady diet of four to seven of these types of plays run for him per game to maximize his productivity and efficiency from the three-point line. It's a great set call by Coach Pop late in the fourth quarter. 